I can't believe we're about to do this. We are going back to the movies. Hey everyone, Ed here with Michelle in the great indoors. And I was able to convince Michelle to go see Alien Romulus. Are you ready, Michelle? You're not ready. You don't want to go Is see Sigourney this. Is Sigourney Weaver in this? No. It's not 1979? No, it's not even affiliated with any of the other oh, movies. It's, a comp it's its own thing, okay? So that's make that makes me even want to go even more. Well, Beetlejuice, you know? I remember Michael Keehan and... It's so good of a movie that they don't even put it on the marquee. How cool is that? Okay, see that? Maybe, but it, maybe it, an alien invaded it yeah. and took it down and wants me to go see Beetlejuice. Wouldn't that be funny if... It, I, I swear to God, I looked it up. It's here. All right. <laughs> All right. We're not going to be able to show you the movie, but we'll probably get some concessions. Michelle's buying the concessions, and she's buying the movie because I bought dinner at uh, Don Tequila. So that's how we roll. We mix it up. We share the... Mm. The things, right, Michelle? We're a Dutch couple. Yes. All right. I can't believe we're going back. This is going to be pretty cool. I hope it's going to be cool. Have you guys been to the movies lately? Put it in the comments and let me hear about it. Okay, Michelle has it up. This is what it is now. It's 1544 for an adult. We got to click on that two times, $30. All right. And then you hit next. And then. It, we can choose where we want to sit. So any of these uh, brownish ones, I think, are available. I don't want to. I want to go further back. So let's go. Go right there. No, I want to go back. Right there. That's where all the cool people sit in the back. In the back. Yeah, in the back. Okay. I have a nice back. All right, we're I? gonna pay now. All right. Okay. Okay. The tickets are printed. It was like thirty dollars, and look at the line for the concessions. Holy cow. Well, we got time. We're ahead of schedule for the movie, and this is the Regal of Willoughby. Pretty nice, just as I remember it. Some things have never changed. They got their service count over here, and this is a room for um, birthdays. Okay, cool. You can rent this out and have your birthday party here. I like that. I don't think I remember. Maybe this was always here. I don't know. Put in the comments if you guys have it's probably been here, like I said, it's been a few years since we've been in here. So, they got the Beetlejuice, that's all over the place, that's been showing. And uh, I'm just going to let Michelle do her thing, and then we'll talk about the movie afterwards to give you our recap of what we thought of Alien Romulus. Nice. These are concession prices, fountain drinks. A large is $8.20, medium is $7.70, and a mall... Small, small is 720 so if you're going to pay 720 for a small, you may as well get the large, right? The pretzel combo, the pizza combo, oh, they got pizza here and burgers and chicken. Wow, I don't go to the movie theater to have a meal though, but I guess nowadays they want you to experience everything, you know, but I'm more of a popcorn person. I remember in the past you would get a large and you could get free refills. But I don't know, they got the single combo, which is $11 for the large. And I think that includes a drink and an M&M. &M. A hot dog combo, I can't see that far, it's a little cheaper. And they have the nacho combo, and the nacho combo is $8.20 for the large. Alright, and like a chicken combo over here, chicken tenders. You're looking at wow where are the prices on that I don't know burger I, I would never even think about getting something like that here but again nachos or pop or hot dog that's what I'm here for and of course they have all the standard candies that you'd expect from your movie experience and then they also Michelle's gonna like that they have sweet leaf unsweetened tea here and there pretty cool decided to forego the line because the line wasn't moving at all so we're like the first ones in first ones here first ones here <laughs> um, I think everyone that's going to see the movie is still standing in the concessions because if you're waiting for people to make hot dogs and hamburgers you're gonna be waiting a long time so in my mind let's just enjoy the movie if I want to get a drink later i could always do that when there is less of a line or maybe we could get ice cream afterwards what do you think michelle ice cream 
All right. We're on the second row in the middle, I believe. Second row from the top. All right. This is that new seating thing. It's uh, number nine and number 10, I believe. Nine and hold on here. Nine and eight. All right. And there's Michelle. I love these uh, new reclining <laughs> seats. That is so fun. I see why I paid thirty dollars. Yeah. All right. So are you excited? To, I know that you're not a big fan of the Alien series, but I am. And you know, I even saw them showing the Alien movie on TV to get people warmed up for this. It's so, okay. Yeah. Hey, you, you took me out to dinner. This is a double date. There this you is, go. This is old school dating. No casino, you know? This is how we used to live. That's right. All right, you guys. I'll if I have something to show you, I'll show you later. Just hang around. Like, comment, and subscribe to The Great Indoors as we are at Regal Cinema in Willoughby Commons. Awesome. Okay, just as I guessed, we're like a half an hour into the movie, and the line is pretty much shorter but at this point we've decided to get ice cream after the movie and we're about a half an hour into the movie and we still have yet to see alien activity so they're developing the story it's so far pretty good but let's get back into it and see where it leads us i'll see you guys after the movie's over nice so michelle what did you think of alien romulus a lot of action a lot of suspense and surely full pack of action. Wow. Yeah, I gotta say, I was very into that movie. Um, I'm a big fan of the Alien series, and I, and I didn't know how they would go with a whole reboot, but they did a great job. They have uh, all new characters, but Ash, is uh, the guy that plays Ash in the original one, his mm -hmm. voice is in it. So there's a nice connection to the past. A lot of action and... You could see, like, they took a lot of the ideas from the first one and put it into this one. But it's definitely, I would say, worthy of the Alien series. It might be one of the better ones since the second one, in my mind. And when they had Aliens, yeah. the first one, the second one, this one was right up there with that. All Sigourney right. Weaver, you know, she wasn't would be in proud, it, would be that, proud yeah. of this new Kaylee yeah. uh, taking her place. Yeah. She's no Ripley, but... You know. But she's got the spirit of Ripley, you know? Yeah, and absolutely, that's good. yeah. All right. Well, listen, I'm probably going to go get ice cream now. That's probably not going to be the video, but I do appreciate you guys sticking around to the very end with the video. Like, comment, and subscribe to The Great Indoors as we return to the movies to see Alien Romulus. And I'm giving it a thumbs up. Michelle? Okay, thumbs there you up. go. <laughs>